If you've watched my YouTube channel in the past year, you'll know that my son Dawson is really getting into mountain biking and taking to gravity riding and jumping. Living in Florida as mountain bikers can be somewhat challenging to say the least. I choose my zip code based on my job and friends. If it weren't for that, we would be living in the mountains and it is a topic that has come up quite frequently in our household. So as a good dad, I wanna make sure my son can progress his skills as he wants. Now we can't build mountains in the backyard, but we can build jumps. And so that's what we're starting. Dawson has been begging to do this for like two years. And I finally feel like now's the time. So we're about to get a bunch of dirt and a bunch of wood and start building. Finally got your dirt, Dawson. <laughs> He's excited. It's jump building day. Excited, Doss? Yes. So we're building a sawhorse first. And it's raining, which is actually perfect weather for building because you don't wish you were out riding. So we're gonna set up our canopy and then we're gonna start building. I just lay it on its side. Building the sawhorse. Got our wood laid out. It's a lot of wood. I'm like, okay, I'm gonna have Dawson's first time using a circular saw. Now that you're doing this one again and you got it kind of down, focus on keeping this tight against that and we'll just guide it right along for you. All right. Yep. And then as soon as you feel it break through that wood, let go of that trigger. Yeah. Because it'll it'll catch like it just did. Yeah. Hold it, fixed foot radius. We're gonna end up. Seven foot radius, move it a foot in, it'll start seven there and six there. Right there. I thought they were the deck screws. Five feet, eight inches. That's a big jump. You can just go up, turn around, and come back down on it, if you can get enough speed. That looks like a wall coming up That's to it. That's the only beer my wife likes. Any beer with coconut in it, so Cigar well, City. So many looks like it's sturdy enough. And we gotta paint it and build the roll in. That's gonna be another day. Now it's time to build the roll in. So we were gonna use 12 foot long four by fours, but we ended up getting 16s because we wanted to go pretty deep in the ground and we wanted to go a little bit higher on the platform. So we're digging six three foot deep holes. Doing a good job, Dawson. Nice. We got the post in the ground. So now we've got to square everything up, pour in the quick creep, let it dry for a few days, and then build the platform. So we got the four by fours set and square with some quick creep. That's high. So we went three feet in the ground and we got 13 feet high. 
So we're probably going to put the platform at the very top and then build some railing on top of that. So this is the temporary jump that Dawson built. We'll repurpose this dirt once we get the other one going, but he just needed something to ride. This project's taking a while. So we'll go ahead and end this video here because this is, like I said, taking a while. And next is to build the platform and then the ramp coming down. We still got some ideas of how we're gonna do it because we built the platform a little bit higher than what we had originally engineered. Uh, I think we're, we may have it kind of like a little bit mellow at the top and then drop pretty steep at the bottom, but the backyard project coming along. All right, that'll wrap up this video. Thanks for watching.